Okay, I wanted to tell you guys about the shower that we purchased. The actual shower panel. It's a whole kit. So it came with the base. And the kit is by Royal Homes. I got it from Wayfair. It is like a 36 by 36, but the exact dimensions is like 34.5 by 76. Because our bathroom was pretty tight. And we only had like a 36 inch opening. So, excuse the background. We got stuff everywhere because we're doing construction. So, what we wanted to show you today is how to put together the unit. So, you get these two bars. Here you get this top bar and the bottom bar. The instructions are not very detailed in terms of telling you how to put the shower together these are the instructions here it tells you everything that comes with it and the things that came with it was not exactly what you needed you needed more stuff so we had to go to the store to buy the additional things that we needed but so this comes already attached to the frame so your glass that's going to go up against the wall your first glass in the frame is already attached so then you have to attach your this glass to the bottom frame and then the top frame like i was telling you and they gave us these quarter inch screws which initially were not fitting in every hole no these are the these are the half one inch okay these quarter inch yeah because when you go these here okay now look at those and look at these no they gave us these kind no yeah these two these, them the ones that, that they want us to put in there see these ones for the drywall right so these were the ones these they initially the ones gave us that's supposed to, that they gave us to go in there mm -hmm. but then they gave us these also these little ones well, that we don't know yet what these go to. We haven't even exactly. used them yet. But can't you tell these what we went to Menards to buy right, is different just, than each and every one of the screws that I done showed you? Right. These are um, half inch screws that we just went to Menards. They're number six style. If you want to get the box to show them exactly. If you wanted to put purchase in this unit, because it was on sale on Wayfair. See, and this is the box that we have to wind up going to get. Comes with eight Phillips head flat screws, uh, pan head screws, rather. So, we just wanted to show you that that's an issue with this particular shower. And it's so tight to get into these little bitty holes on the side. And you drop the screws like thousands of times. <laughs> so, you know, if you got a magnetic screw head that actually works pretty well, that might be a bit of advice for you doing a shower. And you have to have eight of those screws to go two at the top, two at the bottom, and two on that side at the top and bottom as well. So you need a total of eight. So this is... The, uh, right. So these, they came with them. They did provide um, those with our shower all four corners mm -hmm. make sure that you get them in all four corners all right so they need to be put in all four corners and the shower the base came in here separated and then the shower glass came in this box so it will be delivered in two separate boxes and it may not come the same day so if you did decide to go with this unit i'm going to link it in the description so you'll be able to see which one it was and then what you need to do to improvise if you run into any complications along the way so i'm just letting you know that and then i'll get back to you if we run into any more problems or try to show you step by step if i can just by showing you what to do as, as you do uh, install it. And here's a, just an example of what you had to go through. Yeah, having a magnetic screwdriver is a big help. 
versus Chance. <laughs> you got to drop this a million times. But well, we had it hoisted up on the couch here first to give it a little bit more um, assistance to get that screw in there. But yeah, look. but they do recommend that you use a. Um, and see, hold this. See, this these screws. You got to use a little bit of force to get them behind there. Or else you'll just be forever strong. Because they don't go through the hole. These are the ones that we want some Menards to get. Yep. And I don't know what your local hardware store is, but those should be sold anywhere that has screws in their hardware store. Yeah, but in order to make this a smooth transition, they do recommend you have a table and all this other stuff to put it on so that you won't have to have this type of hassle. But screws for this component does make a difference. <laughs> yes, yeah, you'll be all day. Yeah, the ones that initially came with it, they only gave us four and we needed about 12 of them anyway because you need them for this piece here. So you need four because it's four doors that's going to require that. But that's how this had become a, a I'm going to say a nightmare, but you know, that's dealing with the European manufacturers. Yep. You know, he tried to play me and say I got it from eBay. You know, dealing with eBay products because he's had the luck of the run. <laughs> with eBay products with some catalytic converters <laughs> and he had to go back and replace them again after getting them from there and it's just not the best quality sometimes on eBay but it's together we, now <laughs> <laughs> it handles it, sometimes it gets the job done because I we did get the shower panel tower from eBay and that works really well so I think I showed you that but if you want a link of that too I'll drop it in the description on that video with the shower panel installation. So now this is everything is all screwed in. Now we can get to the doors or we might actually install the doors inside the bathroom because that might be a little bit easier because we don't want to be carrying this heavy little unit through the house to get to the bathroom. So that might be something for you all to consider too when installing it, that this thing is pretty heavy. And um, you do not want to be having to carry this through your house if it's just two people with, and, and potentially might break it. Mm -hmm. And another thing that we most definitely want to recommend, you get you a good, good screwdriver. Some of these screwdrivers, that we have been using like <laughs> with these type of heads or whatnot. They've been sliding off the screw, just been one big old headache. But invest in your nice screwdriver, it will get the job done. And actually that screwdriver was just a dollar <laughs> and some change at Menards. So again, these videos aren't sponsored by anybody, but you know, just keeping in mind that, you know, we just want to recommend certain things that work best for us and you may have your own set of tools so whatever works good for you guys all right well i'll catch you guys on in a few i'm going to show you once we get to the door section he's just screwing in this is how you put this piece on that's supposed to hold the glass on that side yep. and again parting our stuff is everywhere we have been out of town when we come home sometimes we throw our stuff <laughs> just until we get relaxed then we come back and do a sweep of everything all right